Hi everybody, today we're going to install the 5 port gigabit desktop switch, the DGS2205. Hi everybody and welcome back to another episode of D-Link TV DIY. I'm Mike and I'm here to help you get more out of your network. So let's say that you filled up the LAN ports on the back of your router and you have another wired device that you want to connect. What do you do? The solution is to use a desktop switch um, to add more ports. Now one of the things to keep in mind is that when you connect the desktop switch to the router, you're going to be using one of the ports on the router and one of the ports on the switch to do the actual connecting of the switch to the router. So when you're going to add more devices, what you need to do is a little bit of math and see if adding a five port switch is going to be enough for you or if you want to add an eight port switch. So one of the cool things about the switch that we're going to connect today, which is the five port gigabit desktop switch, the DGS2205, is that it's part of the D-Link Green line of networking products. So what that means is that um, the switch itself has technology in it that's going to shut off any ports that aren't being used. The other thing that it's going to do is it's going to measure the cable length and it's going to adjust the power levels down according to how uh, long or short the cables are. Um, so let's go ahead and look and see what's inside of the package. So in the package, you'll find the switch, the power supply, some screws and plastic wall mounts in case you want to mount it on the wall, and the CD with the manual in it. But you're also going to need to provide an Ethernet cable to connect the switch to the router. To connect the switch to the router, just disconnect one of your devices from the router and connect it to the switch. Then take the cable that we provided and connect it into the empty port on the router, then into one of the empty ports on the switch, then just connect the power adapter from the switch into a surge suppressor. Well, there you have it. The easiest, most cost-effective way to add more ports to your network with absolutely no configuration involved. Everything's done automatically for you. And uh, the nice thing about this switch is it's gonna save you money in the long run using the uh, green networking technology that I talked about before. So that's gonna do it for this episode of Dealing TV DIY. I'm Mike and thanks for watching.